Hello everyone, welcome to Think Computer YouTube channel. In this video, I will explain how to convert binary numbers to decimal form. So let us take an example of a binary number. 101101 base 2. So as we know that in binary, we have only two digits that is 0 and 1. We call it bits in binary. So we have only two bits 1 and 0. So this is an example. If I want to convert this number into decimal, that means I want to convert from base 2 to base 10. So how to do? Let's see. First we will write down the number 101101 and then we will put power value 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So you need to apply power values right to left starting with 0. Then you will be writing this way 1 into 2 to the power 5. Okay, 1 is that bit means that digit into 2 to the power the power value which is written. Okay, why 2 to the power because it is binary plus next digit is 0. 0 into 2 to the power 4 plus next digit is 1 1 into 2 to the power 3 next is 1 1 into 2 to the power 2 next is 0 0 into 2 to the power 1 next is 1 1 into 2 to the power 0 okay so 2 to the power 5 is 32 this term will be 32 then uh, next term will become 0 plus next term 2 to the power 3 is equal to 8 Next term is 4 that is 2 to the power 2, next term is 0 and 2 to the power 0 1 so last term is 1. If you add you get 40, 44, 45 so 45 base 10 that is the converted value of 101101 in binary. Let's take one more example in which we will also have fractional part. In this number the first example I have only taken a number where there is no fractional part. Suppose the number is 101.110. Now in this example, the number has both integral and fractional part. In my previous video, I did explain what is integral part, what is fractional part. Basically, the value before the point is called the integral part. This is integral part 101. And this part after the point is called the fractional part, which is 110. So you need to write down the number 101.110. For the integral part, power values will be starting with 0 only, 0, 1, 2, 3, right to left, okay? And for the fractional part, power values will be minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, so on. That will be left to right. So now if I write 1 into 2 to the power 2 plus 0 into 2 to the power 1, same logic, the binary bit into 2 to the power, the power value, okay? Plus 1 into 2 to the power 0. Coming to the fractional part, 1 into 2 to the power minus 1 plus 1 into 2 to the power minus 2 plus 0 into 2 to the power minus 3. So the first term will be 2 to the power 2 that is 4. Next term will be 0 plus next term 2 to the power 0 is 1. Now in the fractional part which we have 2 to the power minus 1, so that we can write as 1 by 2 to the power 1. The next term similarly that is 2 to the power minus 2 we can write 1 by 2 to the power 2 okay plus the next term is 0. So in the integral part 4 plus 1 we are getting 5. Now the first fractional part which is 1 by 2 to the power 1 is basically 1 by 2 which is 0 0.5 and the next term which is 1 by 2 to the power 2 which is 1 by 4 basically so 1 by 4 is equal to 0 0.25 okay. And if you add, you get 5.75, 5.75 base 10. 